In the Mediterranean, there is never anything to spare. In the Sierras de Cazorla, a Spanish imperial eagle is beginning its hunting day. It hangs in the sky and surveys its territory. Extraordinarily powerful eyesight reveals the woodland animals below. Spanish imperial eagles and Iberian lynxes are the great apex predators of the Mediterranean home oak woodlands. And both lynx and eagle are expert rabbit catchers. The small furry mammals comprise the main part of their diet. Spanish imperial eagles are great hunters, but this young female hasn't perfected her technique yet. She's still missing out on a good number of kills. Most of the time, rabbits can dodge their attacker's claws, jaws and beaks. But sooner or later, the predators hit their mark. As the increasingly hungry young female eagle tries to hunt, an adult has already caught its daily ration and is enjoying lunch. And yet, despite their status as great hunters, the imperial eagles cannot eat in peace. Winter is very harsh in the south, and hunger bites hard for all creatures. Red kites have evolved a solution to work as a team. The eagle eats as best it can, suffering a noisy, bothersome onslaught from the smaller birds of prey. It's a war of nerves that sometimes elevates from the purely vocal. Close by, the young eagle finally has a well-deserved prize. But she cannot escape the kites either. The scrounging brother won't leave her alone. The red kites harass the eagles without rest. Taking turns, they attack again and again in what seems like perfect synchronization. Eventually, the mature eagle gives up. It's more trouble than it's worth. So she abandons her half-eaten rabbit. The pair of imperial eagles, young and old, both retreat. This is one battle that has been lost. Only for another soon to rage. Now the kite spirit of cooperation seems to evaporate. The winners must divide the prize, but the remains of the rabbit won't go far. And so they give each other the same medicine they gave the eagles. The constant fighting of the kites is exhausting. But through their vocal and physical confrontations, they manage to survive the winter, distributing the meager leftovers abandoned by the eagles.